Today, I would like to talk about double consonants in Japanese. In Japanese, whenever double consonants occur, there is always a small t in it. Let's see some examples and learn how it should be pronounced correctly. Okay, so here is an example, yokatta. As you can see, there is small t in the word, and some students pronounce this in a wrong way, such as yokata. When there are double consonants in the word, you need to make sure the small t is also included. Here is the correct pronunciation, yokata. Same thing in this word, yukuri. Some students pronunciate this word like yukuri. But you need to always make sure to include the t as well. The correct pronunciation will be yukuri. Okay, let's look the last example of double consonants. Here is the word nikko. This is a famous place in Japan for sightseeing. Some students pronunciate this word nikko. But you need to make sure to include the small t as well. The correct pronunciation will be nikko. Okay, so let's move on and see some examples of how these errors are corrected in ACT class. This is one way that you can help students who are struggling with the chisai tsu in Japanese. I'll be acting as the student. この仕事どうでしたか。あ、良かったです。聞いてください。よかった。行ってください。あ、良かった。はい。どこに行きましたか。あ、ニコに行きました。聞いてください。ニコ。はい。もう一度聞いてください。ニコ。はい。ニコは何をしましたかはい。ゆっくり全部見ました。聞いてください。ゆっくり。聞いてください。あ、はい。ゆっくり。